Right, happening tomorrow, the Detroit Lions and uh, Olympia Entertainment or Olympia Development of Michigan uh, will come together to celebrate District Detroit as the premier dynamic sports and entertainment destination from pretty much anywhere. The District Detroit night will take place at Ford Field as the Lions face the New England Patriots. And this morning, we're fortunate enough to have Tom Wilson, president and CEO of Olympia Entertainment, in studio with us this morning. Tom, good morning. Good morning. And thank you so much for joining us. Tell us, what is District Detroit night at Ford Field? Well, District Detroit night is a celebration of what's going on in downtown Detroit. And, and we started with just an arena, as you remember. And then Chris Illich, to his credit, said, we've got to think bigger. Let's think 50 blocks bigger, which means you're taking in all the sports teams down there and creating a district of entertainment and fun and restaurants and, and uh, theater and just about everything you can imagine. And so all the teams have gotten together. This is our fourth team, fourth night, where we celebrate District Detroit with this time the Detroit Lions tomorrow night. All the fans are uh, are going to have a great time. They're going to participate in trivia contests and things like that. Mm -hmm. And the first 15,000 will get a, a free Lions District Detroit hat. And this is a really good looking hat. And, you know, I, I love the fact that it is simple and clean. You know, just put the Lions logo right there in a beautiful uh, sort of silver against that black background. Tell me a little bit about how the teams have been working together. This is, uh, I guess, sort of a return to Detroit for a lot of the teams. They'd been scattered in the suburbs. Now they're all back. What's the relationship like between the teams and the organizations? Yeah, it's really never been better. And I think we all kind of realize now, now that the Pistons are back downtown, because for years they were out in uh, Auburn Hills, of course, after the Silver Dome. And there was always a, at least a perceived animosity. And that's gone. Everybody is working because we all understand that anything that's good for the Red Wings or the Pistons or the Lions or the Tigers is good for the city of Detroit. The fans come in, they park in our park parking lots, they stay in our hotels, they eat at our restaurants, and the whole city benefits from the excitement and the energy that sports brings. And of course, uh, part of that energy and excitement and certainly one of the uh, keys to District Detroit, Little Caesars Arena. Tell us where things are. We know we're getting close. Well, we're a week away from getting the keys. So right. September 1, they turn it over to us. Uh, then we start a preview week with ribbon cuttings and then opportunities for the community to come through and, and get a, a preview look at the arena. And then it's going to open with Kid Rock. And it is an arena unlike, and I mean this, unlike anything I've ever seen. And you could go there uh, 10 times and never see everything that uh, this arena is going to offer. It's a game changer for the entire city. Of course, there's a lot going on uh, at Little Caesars Arena and you're the president and CEO, so that's one hat you wear. But just as a sports fan and as an entertainment fan, when you walk through the Little Caesars Arena, what stands out to you? What makes you go, wow? Well, there are so many things, and, I, and some of them are going to be surprises. And, okay. and you won't see them until opening night of the Red Wings game. Uh, but there's projection on this jewel skin, 100 yards long, with 12 laser projectors that can put the game up there or the act and the entertainment right up there on that screen. Bigger, bigger than life. Nothing you've ever seen in Vegas or Disney or Times Square or anything like that. And then things in the bowl, sight lines that are the best in hockey. Every aspect of the fan experience is going to be improved when you come to Little Caesars Arena. All right, I'm in. You got me all pumped up. <laughs> now tell us a little bit more about District Detroit night. When is it and how can people participate? It's tomorrow night at the Lions game at Ford Field. And so come on down. And, and obviously, if you're the first 15,000, you get the hat. But there will be trivia contests for prizes. Uh, there'll be social media interaction that you'll have. There'll be photo opportunities to get involved in District Detroit. So it's a it's kind of a complete immersive experience, but at least you'll walk out knowing a little bit more about it and being excited about downtown Detroit as we are. All right, I'm excited too. Thank you so much, Tom Wilson, Thank you, President Ken. and CEO of Olympia Entertainment. And you know, we're thinking, we're talking hockey, talking football. Well, let's take a look at the forecast. 